morning everyone yes uh, did you sleep well yes uh, today also we are here again through tabernacle class uh, i'm happy to share this tabernacle i'm very thankful because uh, this monday morning we can start through sharing the word of God. So through the tabernacle, uh, we can discover the image of Jesus Christ. So we can uh, cl come close to the Jesus Christ. Yes, uh, as we share the tabernacle, each part of the things. Uh, last time I told you uh, the coat of the tabernacle. Do you remember which material used for coat of the tabernacle? Fine of an linen. So you can see uh, today uh, you will see there are many posts. So when you see the post, uh, you see there are 20 pieces of the pillar and you will see opposite side also 20 pieces and here you see the 10 piece and the other one also 10 total 60 piece of pillar so when you see this pillar uh, you see the different material like uh, you see here uh, this one is called uh, it's called base base or socket and this is uh, uh, the villa the post and you will see here it's like hook and this one, like, uh, uh, it's called cap. So, all you see different the material. So, each material, uh, we will see uh, the image of Jesus Christ. So, we can see uh, some spiritual meaning inside of the material. So we see in the book of Exodus, chapter 27, verse 10. We read verse 10. And it's 20 fillers, and their 20 sockets shall be bronze. Thus, the hooks of the fillers and their bands shall be silver. So, as you hear scripture say, uh, exactly the pillars material uh, are written in the Bible. So, this socket, socket shall be bronze. So, we see each different, you know, pillars material. Here we see this one, you know, the material is bronze and this is a post and this hook material silver so today i want to share about this bronze bronze this uh, bronze uh, used for sockets so, so uh, we need to know the bronze means Actually, this bronze uh, symbolize. I think you remember when Israel, when they was in the wilderness. I think you remember like Israel. Uh, they complained before God. So that time, God sent uh, to Israel the fire serpent. So anyone who were beaten by serpent, they died. But 
through Moses, God say, those who see this uh, bronze serpent, bronze serpent, they will be saved. So, uh, actually, this bronze, you no know, bronze, give us spiritual uh, uh, means is uh, judgment. Can you repeat judgment? Judgment. Uh, judgment. So, anyone who see bronze serpent through bronze, it's like already you know judgment finish. So it's like the punishment already conclude, finish. So when you know they were beaten by fire serpent, because uh, this uh, bronze serpent, you know, uh, symbolize already judgment finish, already poison finish. You understand? So anyone who see this bronze from the poison, you know, they uh, uh, get safe because already judgment finish. So bronze mean the judgment over, like all the punishment over. So the Bible same, same like uh, bronze serpent, we see uh, in the book of John chapter 3, verse 14, we see uh, like verse 14, and as Moses lifted up the serpent in the wilderness, even so much the Son of Man be lifted up. So, as Moses lifted up serpent, which serpent? Bronze, bronze serpent. So, even Son of Man be lifted up. You know, Jesus Christ is the uh, the man who will be uh, uh, will be lifted up at the time through the John chapter thir uh, three verse fourteen. You no, know, Jesus Christ is same like the bronze serpent. That's why, as uh, the people got saved, anyone who so the bronze serpent, they can be saved from the, from, from the uh, poison. So likewise, the people who watch Jesus Christ, they can be saved from what? From sin. So anyone who watches sin, uh, watch Jesus, they can be saved. Because through Christ, Already judgment over. So, you know, the bronze serpent explain us the judgment of God is over through Christ. So, when you see like a fila, you no, know, all those fila, you no, know, this, this what? Uh, this socket or base, uh, base, it material uh, bronze. So it is a bronze. So when this fila stand, you know, uh, stand well, it should stand by, you know, this the base uh, material, the bronze. So, what does this mean? You know, actually, when you see the material of uh, uh, you know, all the fillers, actually, filler, uh, maybe next time I will explain. When you see this uh, uh, post, this one is wood, wood. 
For this wood, there is no uh, the exactly which uh, material is not mentioned in the Bible. So we don't know exactly which wood, uh, which wood used for uh, this pot. It means actually we can use all the material of wood, whether it's acacia, even you know, just uh, uh, even apple, uh, apple tree, or uh, we don't know which tree material. It means uh, we can use all kinds of wood, all kinds of wood. So this one symbolizes the true Christian, like we, we can be used anyone, whether they are good, whether, whether they are evil, anyone can be like Christian, but they should be, uh, should be stand on the, the base of this bronze, bronze. So through the, this bronze, we can discover we must uh, put on base the judgment of God through Christ. So Jesus Christ already uh, received all of our punishment through his sacrifice. He died on the cross. That's why even though you know, we can use all different kinds of wood, but this wood should be stand on the base of bronze. So we see, you know, how we should do spiritual life uh, on which base. You know, we should do the spiritual life based on uh, Jesus Christ's uh, salvation. So Jesus Christ already washed all of our sins. But those who put not bronze in their base heart, the people who put other things, not the bronze, if the people put on their heart on base on other things, you know, their spiritual life will be difficult. So which thing they put in their heart on their base, like based on their behavior. For example, if they put on their behavior, if they do good, they think, ah, my spiritual life is good. But if they do evil, then they feel, you know, their spiritual life is not good. They cannot do like this. So those people who put their on their works, you know, they can be shaken their spiritual life according to their behavior. So it's like, if they do good, they uh, think good. But if they don't do good, they think the spiritual life is not good. Because it is just uh, based on their, their works. Also, there are people who uh, put on their base according to their emotion. emotion. If their emotion, like if they are happy, they are good. Huh? But if they, they feel not happy, then they think uh, spiritual life is also not going through well. You know, they are the one who put based on their feeling. But, you know, true Christian, where they put their base spiritual life, they must put you know, based on the bronze. Uh, Jesus Christ uh, wash our sin. So those who believe this one, you know, they do spiritual life not according to their works or not according to their feeling. Uh, if they feel good, they think, ah, I'm doing good. But if they feel not good, maybe they shake their heart. They feel like 
God cannot walk because their feeling is not. So when they see their feeling, it seems like God don't help them. You understand? Then they will be somehow trouble and difficult. Also, those who base on their works. When they do good, yes, maybe they feel, ah, God will walk through me. But if they do evil or do mistake, then they feel, God cannot help me. God will be not pleased me so that they cannot do future life. Understand? Yeah. So those who put spiritual life on their uh, base, of Jesus Christ, they believe exactly God help me. Why? Jesus already worship our sin. So through Christ, they believe I connect with God, then God help wherever I go. Whatever I do, they can believe in us. That's why even though there are so many material, but God say put bronze for the this base socket. So they must make uh, this villa through the socket of bronze. Are you getting me? Yes. There are no other material. Even God didn't say like gold or silver. Uh, or other as only bronze, bronze. Because bronze symbolizes is judgment over judgment. Same like when Israel they was in the wilderness, they saw the bronze serpent. So though they were beaten by uh, scorpion, not scorpion, sorry, <laughs> snake, snake. Even though they were beaten by snake. Fire, uh, the, the, the one which has a strong poison. Uh, but once they see the you know, bronze serpent, they can, uh, they can be cured from the poison. Why? The bronze is mean already over. Uh, already over. Poison already over. So, Jesus Christ, you know, same like bronze serpent, but it's not just a poison. You know, all our the curse, curse, all our sin, and all our problem, all our difficulty, all of our circumstance is over. over. So those who see Jesus huh, is. Uh, it's the time like all things over. You understand? So, you know, this is why we believe in Jesus Christ and see Jesus anytime, everywhere, any situation. So once we see Jesus, uh, even our sin over. And once we see Jesus, all difficulty over. Not only poison, you know, bronze serpent, only work for the poison at the time. You understand? So, the people who see Jesus, you know, they cannot say anymore they are sinners. So they say righteous and holy so that they believe they are connect with God. So, uh, let's see. Uh, all of a sudden, though I didn't prepare, we can see Romans. Romans chapter 8 Romans chapter 8 verse 35 Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall tribulation or distress or persecution or famine 
or nakedness or uh, pales or sword. There is nothing can separate from the love of Christ. So that's why even verse 39, nor height, nor depth, nor any other created thing shall be able to separate us from the love of God which is in Christ our Lord. So as you see here, uh, you see the love of God uh, cannot separate between uh, us and God. Why? Through Christ, all of sin, all of dirty, finished over. So we connect with God once through Christ forever. So God with us, God help us continue. You understand? So those who, you know, uh, put their their heart base through this bronze, then they cannot shake their spiritual life. Why? Through bronze, you know, already I told you, uh, we can con we connect with the God. So those who believe this one, uh, Jesus already finished. So when you do spiritual life, very important to do spiritual life uh, based on this bronze, based on the work of Jesus Christ. That's why when you know God say to Moses, make this pillar. God say you make this pillar through the material of bronze. So this pillar stand through. You know, bronze. So, like they can consider the Jesus Christ and the judgment is over, so that there is no any problem to uh, interrupt with God. Uh, God connect with me. God is with me. So they can do spiritual life with this. Because all the judgment already over. Also, there are, there are uh, one story. There, there was a, a certain happen. A certain man entered into the mountain. So when he was in the mountain, he tried to come out from the mountain, but there was big you know, fire. So this fire came up to even the top of the mountain. So he couldn't find the way to, uh, to, to, to uh, come out from the mountain. So that time he thought, right, now the mount, uh, fire is just coming to him. So that time he thought another way. Ah, uh, yes. Actually, he have you no. Know, the fire match he can use match then he make fire on his side so all you know the place where he was he put the fire open side so even though fire was coming it was okay because he already make fire then this place already over you understand? Already fire over. So even though another fire was coming, it was okay. They place already finish, already finish the fire. Are you getting me? So in this place where you know he make a fire already, this place very okay. No more fire. Because here already fire over. You understand. Likewise, those who are in Jesus Christ is same like the people who was uh, who were in this area, because here already fire over. So like Jesus Christ already over all of our sin. 
That's why right. those who are in Christ, you know, they don't, uh, they don't be in sin, and they cannot say a sinner. They are holy and righteous because already sin over. So even though you know the Satan accuse, ah, you see, uh, he committed sin. He did evil. He is a liar. He is a, a criminal. But those who belong to in Jesus Christ, you no, know, their sin already over. Even though Satan accused a lot, they cannot be tremble or shake. But those who those who are not uh, based on you know Jesus Christ, you know when Satan accuses, for example, after we commit the sin, you know there are a lot of condemnation. Like you see, you you are so evil. How you can say you are true Christian? You are so dirty and evil. That's why many people uh, come out from the church. Why? Satan accused through what they did. But actually, it's not because they come out from, uh, from the church through what they did. It's because their base. Their base is not based on the bronze. You understand? Yes. They're based on the other material. Like uh, I told you, you know, base of works. Those who you know, put their work on their base, if they do good, they think, yes, okay. But if they do evil, they think, now God and me separate. God, I did this. So if how can I say I'm children of God? So that they separate from the God and even separate from themselves. So the base is very important. So when we do spiritual life, we must uh, you know, consider what is my base? Whether my base is under the, my works or under the, my feeling or under the, my emotion. Or through prunes. So we need to think deeply. Most important is that you know, Jesus already died for all of our sin so that we are no longer sinner. We are one with God. So God can help anytime, everywhere, wherever I go. So those who put this you no know, base on their heart, they cannot shake, they cannot tremble. So this is the most important. When we do spiritual life, you know, this is one of the best you know, things we supposed to know exactly. So I wish everyone uh, consider this. The most important is that Jesus already Finish it all of our judgment. Already he finished all of our sin. So that Jesus Christ made us to be united with God. So God can help me, God can walk through me, and God guide me. So those who believe this one, they cannot be troubled, tremble, you know, when we do our spirit. So, do you understand everyone? Yes. So this is one of the most important for the, our spiritual life. Thank you.